Hello everyone, Smox here from Celebrant Quest. I am a registered civil marriage celebrant in Australia, so I love love, but I also love playing video games. And we are back in clan folk. We have the wonderful Anton here going about his business. We also have two workers that are helping us out at the moment, John and Michael. And we've just hit winter. Um, so I think we're looking pretty good for the winter, but, uh, we could still, you know, we could still burn and perish <laughs> or freeze, whichever one. Um, with this campfire, I've just clicked the keep lit button because, um, now that it is winter, everyone's going to be fairly cold and they're going to want to stay in this room to make sure that they stay nice and warm. So we can see in the room here, if we look up at the uh, left-hand corner of the screen, the room temperature is 18.1. Outside though is 2.9 degrees. So we're looking to, uh, yeah, make sure that this stays fairly warm for them. Um, we've got a few things out, you know, the bunnies are being collected by our two little kitty cats here, which is lovely. How's the queen going? Oh, she isn't pregnant anymore, which means that theoretically we should have a little kitten around, but, uh, we don't have a bed for the kitten. So let's put down the bed just so, um, you know, nothing goes bad <laughs> for little kitty. <laughs> Um, let me see. Where's a pet bed? There it is. There we go. We've got a little pet bed in this room, which is a bit dark, so we can't see, but that's okay. Um, I don't know. Where is the little kitty cat? Not sure. So I'm going to make sure we've got plenty of stone picks, because as you can see, we've got a lot of mining to do here in the mountain. Um, so hopefully Michael and John will keep up with that. Oop, who have we got? Margaret. Okay, Margaret, what's your deal? Oh, you're a trader. Awesome. All right, look. We've got Tomcat. We've got a kitten. What are you? You're a boy. Uh, we've got a queen as well. I wonder if we could get another queen and then we could have more cats. Is that just being a greedy cat lady? Hmm. Uh, I think maybe I will. <laughs> who cares? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Margaret, what else? Uh, oh, that's what we... Oh, no, we just sold our queen. Oh, what an idiot. Bring that back. <laughs> that's what we've got. How silly. Okay, this is what Margaret has. Oh, my God, lucky we got the queen back. So we do have a little baby kitten. Oh, so he's around somewhere. She's got some uh, onions. They could actually be quite good for us to buy. You know what? I am oh, I am going to buy the onions. Um, yeah. I, wanna, I might buy the iron as well. I might buy the peat brick. Who cares? Whatever. Thanks, Margaret. Oh, look. There's little kitty there. Hello. So cute. All right. Awesome. So everyone's going on about their day. Yeah, Margaret, you can go now. I'm asking her to leave. Oh, we're building our bridge here as well. That's going to be good. Um, let me see. I might take out some more of these trees. John, what are you collecting? Sticks, maybe? I don't know. What about branches? We might need a... Do we need... Oh, no, we've got 527 branches. I don't think we need new branches. Let's get rid of that. Logs, we've got 36 logs. I don't know how many we need to build this bridge. How many do we need? 10. Okay, so they will need those logs from cutting down the trees. That's fine. Maybe I should make sure that we've got more stone axes as well, just in case. Might do another bow too. How's our tools looking? No one's putting the tools away, fellas. You need to make sure that it's all spick and span <laughs> now that we've got these shelves and everything. All right, what about our food? I don't know if we can get eels from the traps because it's winter. I'll put them on anyway, just in case, but I'm pretty sure that food source is now kind of ceased. We do have our bottles of um, water around as well. We can see that the water's in here. And at the fire, we can actually melt some of this water. So let's do that. 
How much food do we have? We've got five roasted onions. We've got a lot of, or 85 dried mushrooms. I, don't, I wouldn't call that a lot, actually. <laughs> With the roasted onions, I might change this so that we've got 10 at a time. Um, yeah, let's go 10 at a time. I just don't want them to go bad. So what's in here? Oh, onions can go in there. Because otherwise they're going to go bad if they just stay out here. Oh, look, Michael's collecting them. Thank you, Michael. You're a good boy. Our meat stocks are well, well stocked, so that's good. Oh, look how much quicker that is just going over these, the bridges. So much quicker. All right, cool. And we're going to have a heap of peat harvested as well, so that'll be really good. Um, maybe I should make sure we've got plenty of these spades as well. Everything's going so well. I don't think we're going to have an issue for the winter, honestly. Um, who's doing the mining? Let's see. Where is the mining? Here it is. Okay, so Anton's... Uh, John, I might pop mining to your first one, actually. Let's see. Let's see how that affects things. Because if we can get this all mined out over this winter, uh, over the next, what, 10 days, that'll be really good. Oh, look at this. The eel traps are working. Maybe that's because this little creek bit isn't frozen. Hmm. Mind you, so is that big lake. I'm not sure then. I thought all of the traps and those sort of things stopped over the winter. Clearly I was wrong. Feel free to tell me that I was wrong. <laughs> Okay, cool. So John is doing a really good job. That's very cold in that room, but that's okay because all of our food is in there. So we're good with that. Um, did I? Now John and Michael. Oh, who's that? Oh, they're coming. John and Michael, I don't think put on extra clothes, do they? No. I wonder if we can get lady workers so that Anton can have a, a lovely lady friend. Don't know. We'll see. These here are going to be some little bedrooms. Uh, I think I'm... Uh, I don't know. I might make that a bedroom. I'm not sure. All right. Who have we got? Do I pronounce that David? I'm not sure. Yes, let's rent a bed to David. That'd be great. We've got plenty of food. Yeah, we can make heaps more meat. How's the meat going in terms of quality? Yep, you're okay. What about this one? Gosh, look at all this. Yeah, we're fine. Maybe I should make it so that we've got more cooked meat. What have I got at the moment? 20. No, that's heaps of cooked meat. We're good. Ooh, I can hear the wolves. Oh, we don't have any more branches. Let's clear some more trees. And then you know what I think we'll do as well? I think this would be quite a good opportunity to mark out some fields. Mm -hmm. Oh, apparently David's clan. Where's David from? McDougal. Apparently they got we got a minus from McDougal in terms of our <laughs> reputation with them. <laughs> We're on zero anyway, so. Alright, cool. Next day. Look at that little kitty still doing its thing. Very cute, man. All right, so where do I want to put the fields? I think, uh, I think maybe just across the way here. Hmm. I've also got this pile where I've been putting the rubbish, like the dead kind of rotting items. That's probably going to be good for it. Uh, that'll be good for fertilization, but I'm not going to particularly worry about it. I say, let's do it. Let's do it in here. What do I want? Let's see. Planting. I wonder if I can just mark out what I want first. So let's see. Let's do like a nice, oh, there's the end of that field there. Let's just do the field to there. That's good. What's that? A five by four? Uh, and then we're going to get a little, where's a little wall? 
a wattle fence or a dry stone fence? Let's get that dry stone fence because we've got so many fen uh, so many stones. Here we go. And we need to put a little... Hang on, pause, Anton, before you start doing whatever you're doing. Oh, no, you're okay. Uh, we need to put a little gate. There we go. Oh, we've run out of a sickle. Okay, let's make some more sickles. We'll move that to priority number one, actually. What's that? Crafting? Okay, who's on crafting? We've not got, we've only got a little bit of that um, mining done. Who's on crafting? Oh, our friend John has left us. Well, that's fine. So crafting, uh, Michael. Let's put crafting to the top of your list, Michael, just for now. Because, oh, here comes Gilbert. He's a trader by the looks of it. All right, Gilbert, what can we trade to you? Let's have a look. We can trade Pete, which is fine. Um, oh, he wants those things. Okay, we don't have enough in the inventory. Some straw. How much straw do we have? 462. We've got some beans as well. Why don't we buy the beans? Why not? Beautiful. Um, I probably should make some extra food stockpile. I'll just make it just there. And we're going to say the beans can go in there. Yeah, I reckon. What else? Um, and we'll do the roasted onions as well. Where are the roasted onions right now? Oh, they're just sitting inside. Yeah, let's do that. Um, you can go now. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna make this little farm. Um, let's make another farm as well. So what am I going to have in this one, actually, before I continue? What do I want in this one? What can I do? I can do... I don't want grass or reeds. Okay, so... Hmm. I was hoping maybe I could do some... Uh, we'll do trees in this one, but I was hoping I could do some uh, neeps or kale. But we'll have to go out and we'll have to harvest those. So if we get these all ready then that would be great. Let's do the same again. We'll make this one just a little bit bigger and we're gonna do some kale or neeps in this one. All right, we'll do the little stone fence for the little garden. How cute. We'll do another little fence there. Actually, I mean a gate. You know what? We will have to... I'm going to put a gate on the other side as well because that... Yeah, that might be better if they're, you know, accessing from both sides. Great, so we've got that going. Oh, he's making all of our tools. That's awesome. I still haven't been able to make anything in the peat stove. I was hoping that maybe when I got those onions, etc., I'd be able to make something because I've got bowls. Maybe I need some extra clay bowls. Let's make some extra clay bowls. See what... Oh no, I've got five of them because there's four and there's one over there. Hmm. I'm not sure. Oh look, here we go. Look, these traps now. Yeah, we can't use them because of... Um, because of the winter. We need to make a bloomery. I'm gonna... Hmm. I'm gonna risk it and I'm gonna put it outside. We need bricks, do we? Okay, make some more bricks. How many bricks? 50. Make 50. Probably need to harvest some extra clay, actually. There we go. Let's harvest that up. Great. So we've got our little gardens here. We'll do trees on one. We'll do, like, neeps or something in the other. That obviously won't come until we reach, um, until we reach the either spring or summer probably summer because they need a little bit of time to grow we could put another little garden in here i'm not sure um it wouldn't hurt actually because if we had a garden in here 
then we would um, yeah have easy access from home. So let's do that. I don't mind making a few little garden. We could do a berry bush if we wanted to, like berry bush garden, all sorts. Um, let's just do it like a little smaller version of this one. Who do we have here, huh? Put some gates there. Oops, I didn't finish this one. There we go. Dougal. Yes, of course, Dougal. I would love for you to rent a bed. We also, I'm going to put the uh, job board sign down because I need, I'd love another worker or two. But hopefully Dougal will be happy with us and he'll give us some more money. We got 603. That's fine. All right, where is Michael? Let's go back to having hauling as your first one, Michael. It's beautiful music, Dougal. <laughs> All right, excellent. Look, our little, our little clan is coming together nicely. So we'll have our like living spaces in the mountain. We'll have our fields out here. I mean, what could go wrong? The peat still needs to be collected. Our rooms are still nice and warm, so that's great. I'll just put these for collection of branches, just because we are using the branches in the fire to keep that fire lit constantly. I wonder if it would be more efficient to keep the tiled peat stove lit instead. It uses peat bricks. How many peat bricks do we have? Eight wet. How many dry? 63 dry. Uh, you know, I don't think I'll keep that one. Yeah, let's just keep the tiled stove lit. Um, okay, what do we need? We need compost, do we? All right, let's make a compost bin. <laughs> Where do I want the compost bin to go? Um, it would make sense to go near the fields, I guess. You know what I do need to think about too? Is I really need to think about... Who are all these people? I really need to think about um, where I'm going to like keep animals. Because I would love to get some... Hmm... I would love to get some animals, so I don't know where I'm going to put the compost. Let's just put the compost here. I don't know if it needs to be undercover, but we will see. Okay, let's see. Jeanette. Oh, she's a worker. Let's let's hire her. And then maybe, hang on, let's have a little look at you, Jeanette. Maybe, what's she? She's an adult. And we we can join the fam, have her join the family with and partner off with Anton if she likes us enough so let's get her happiness up that'd be really nice all right what do you want you want bluebell and heather oh i can buy neeps from you let's buy some neeps uh look we can do roasted neeps now uh let's make it that this one can do neeps in here as well trader Let's buy the berries because I, yeah, I had a feeling that we needed some more berries to do the next thing. I'm going to buy the wood ash as well, just so we don't have to actually make it. I'm going to, where's those, that serving basket. Let's make a serving basket because I want to, um, it'd be nice to just have the berries and the mushrooms uh, in there. What can I make in here? Roasted neeps. Um... I mean, why not? Too bad I didn't get their seeds because I didn't... Um, let's do 10 at a time for the neeps. I didn't get their seeds because I didn't harvest them. But that will change later. Alright. Jeanette, how do we know if you like us? Let's see. Um, oh, my god. Hello? Ah. Oh. Oh, here's another queen. I'm going to buy another queen because 
If we can get lots of little kitties, that'll make me very happy. So, where am I going for the pet bed? There we go. Alright, we need clay. Barbara, didn't I just purchase from you? I think you can go now, Barbara. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to take off the sign for workers just because... Oof, look at that, 278. I don't know. <laughs> we really need to recruit um, Jeanette to our family. Otherwise, she's just going to be like, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me, you didn't, uh, you didn't pay me. That's all right. Hopefully we'll have some things that we can sell to the trader next time the trader comes. But we're doing just fine. What do we need for here? Clay. That's a gathering. Oops, someone's doing some gathering. Oh, clearing for the field. Uh, no, Jeanette should be doing that kind of stuff, so... I would assume that she's going to... I don't know. Oh yeah, there she goes. She's starting to gather some clay now, so that's really good. So, yeah, we'll have trees here. We'll have some, like, neeps something here when we get them. We'll have some onions. We'll do some kale. Now, what I was saying about having the animals oh I need twine do I um yeah I'd really love to have some animals at some point like some sheep or something that'd be quite fun now where do I want to put them hmm I wonder hmm I wonder if I could like carve out some of this for their little shelter and then just have them sort of here. Mind you, the peat bog is there, so I'm not sure if that would work. I don't know. Oh, our bloomery is done. Let's make, make some iron ingots. Um, let's do... Oops, what am I doing? Let's take those off. Let's make sure that we've always got at least five, I would say, or maybe ten. Let's go with ten. There we go. And we've still got some mining that needs to be done. We've got plenty of food. How's our raw meat going? The raw meat is absolutely fine in here. Okay, we need some more iron ore. Well, uh, to do that, we need to do something with this bog iron. How do we do that? I can't really remember. Hmm. But that's okay. Let's make sure that we've got at least 50 charcoal at all times. Let's make sure we've got at least, I would say at least 100 wood ash as well. Okay, cool. Our little fence is almost complete there and almost complete here as well. Just need a little bit more twine so that we can make those little gates. How are our queens going? It's a tomcat. Queen. Okay, that second queen is now pregnant. So that's cute. We're going to have little kittens. Very cute. It's not raining right now, so everything outside is going. Like, I don't think the bloomery will work when, um, when it rains. But, hey. Oh, look. Michael's about to leave us. Michael, you have been such a great help. Thank you so much. Let's put, uh, no, let's just leave it with Anton and Jeanette at the moment. How's Jeanette going? Satisfaction maxed. Okay, how do we make that satisfaction go up? Um, public poop shame. Oh, shit, yeah, we should make, <laughs> excuse the pun, we should make a, um, a little private toilet. I forgot about that. Okay, where will I do that? I think... Hmm. I need somewhere where... Let me see. Basic needs. Where's the poop hole? <laughs> In 
it is here. So. Uh, I don't want to make, do I want to make it right near the, <laughs> right near the garden? I don't think I do. Um. <laughs> I could make it butt up against this little, I don't know. It needs to be, because it's a poop hole, it needs to be in the soft ground. So, da -da -da. why is this taking me so long to figure out? <laughs> uh, you know what, screw it. I'll just do it against the fence. It doesn't matter. Um, so we'll need a little wall there. So we'll do that one there. That'll be a wall. We'll do that there. Awesome. Okay, need a little wall for our little toilets. Um, let's go with, how much peat? No, because we want that for the fire. Oh, oh, it's a trader. Oh, eggs. Okay. Oh, we've got some kale. Hmm. I don't think we need any of those, but thank you. I'm going to say be on your way. Good, sir. Let's just go the door wall, I think. Who the hell are so many people showing up at my door? Another trader. Um, no, I'm okay. Thank you. I can't sell any of those. Okay. That's good for next time to know for the next winter. If I get more of those, then we can actually sell those. Like the heather and that sort of thing. We need a door. There we are. There's our little poopy rooms. We'll do a little window. I don't know if that'll help. <laughs> Maybe I should have made them a little bit bigger. Actually, let's just make them a little bigger. Just so people don't get like, you know, claustrophobic in there. I <laughs> don't know if that's a thing. There we go. That'll be good. Great. I, f I totally forgot that they would need those little private bathrooms. So at least we've got those going now, which is good. If I was feeling extra generous, I could do a third one, but I really don't think we need it. Ooh, what else do we do? Oh, an iron wall torch. So this doesn't throw any sparks and it operates. It doesn't operate in the rain. So what do I want to light up? I think I want to light up this little bedroom. If I could get it to stick to the wall, that'd be nice. There we go. How are you going, Jeanette? Oh, she's going to leave us. Cleanliness is down. She has no fun. What do you mean, dude? There's heaps of instruments you can play. <laughs> she's bored. Oh, uh, well, don't do that then. Why don't you like, I don't know, fix up the trees or something instead? Well, that's a shame. Jeanette, uh, Jeanette will not be joining our household. <laughs> oh, we can do a meat sp smoker and a stone fireplace. Can be used for lighting, heat, cooking, and only throw sparks forwards. Okay, that's good to know. I did have a comment in one of, in the first video saying that sparks don't go up, they go outwards. So thank you for that. That was very good to know. Oh, look, a timbery. We can make planks. Let's put this up here and we'll make some planks. Okay, we still need some twine. I need to make quite a few of those then. So, do, is it because we don't have any water? Is that why you're unhappy and you can't get clean? Is that the whole... 
Is that where we're coming undone, Jeanette? It could very well be. Who's on cooking? Oh yeah, Anton is. Anton, if you could like just make some... <laughs> make some more water. Oh no, we've got heaps of water. I'm not sure what she's complaining about. Um, oh, she's away. Bye. Where are you? Bye, Jeanette. Thanks for sticking by. And there was one. You know what? I'm not going to worry about the job board just yet. I think Anton is going just fine by himself. Are you, mate? Now we've got those poop holes. Let's get rid of this poop hole. <laughs> it's so funny saying poop hole. Oh, we don't have any stones. I never thought I'd see that day. There we go. More stones that we can collect. Look, just a man and his cats. So what's he doing? He's drinking and he's cleaning, is he? No, he's just drinking. So he's not clean either. Hmm. How do we make a little bathtub? It's obviously not available to us yet. Hello, Fergal. Yes, we can rent a bed to you for sure. He's using our new toilet. Very good. I'm going to uh, need to roof these off as well, aren't I? So what sort of roof do I want to do? Um, let's just do... How many stones do we have? Oh, I've got a heap. Why can't I see them up here? Where are they? That's all good. I'm just going to make these stone roofs just because we've got a whole heap of those materials. I'm also going to clear these stumps. Let's cut some more of these trees as well. I might need another worker actually. Why don't I get that? I'm going to put that on. Fergal is staying with us. Where do you belong to? McCulloch. How does McCulloch like us? Jeez, not at all. Reputation level one. Hmm. What day are we in? We're winter five. So we're halfway through winter. We need a few extra bits and bobs. I get that. But right now we're just taking care of the, the small things. At least everybody's warm. So that's good. Pete stove is still, uh, Still can't work that out. <laughs> Flax retting. Okay, I know I need some more heather. I need flax stems for flax retting. Flax seeds. Did we never get any flax seeds? Huh. Okay, well, I mean, all in good time. Not much we can do about that in winter. Oh, look at my god. We can see into this, into this room now. How do I keep this one lit with straw? Why don't we keep that lit? Oh, it heats the room as well, but it looks like 18 is pretty much where we get to for these rooms, which is fine. Um, oh, who do we have? Oh, a trader. Okay, what can I sell to you? Because I feel like I'd like to sell a few things. So let's sell... I have 32 dry hide. Let's sell our hide. I don't really need to make these anymore. Uh, let's sell a bit of this hay as well. There we go. All right, thank you. How are we going? We still need those stones. We'll need to get a little bit of help on that one. What objects have just come up? An iron standing torch. Cool. 
Well, I feel much better now that we can see into these rooms. That's quite good. Look at we've got our decorative hides on our beds. That's quite cute. Oh, another trader. We could sell the kitten. Is that mean? Oh, I could have sold some fur cloaks. That's all right. Um... We could sell some of our sticks. What about the logs? We've only got 47 of those. I kind of want to hang on to those. Let's, um, hmm. Let's buy this iron. And let's sell some sticks, eh? Oops. How much money do you have left? 70. Yeah, that'll do. All right, cool. I feel like that was very good. All right, Essie's leaving, Anton, you're building. Must be a bit of a lonely existence for poor old Anton. I need to get him a, a friend. <laughs> Iron ore pile. Okay, we'll just add that to the different piles. I really need to um, change all of this to make sure that we're, you know, we're storing them. I, I think I'll probably make a storage room inside. I mean, I could just bury, uh, bury, mine into the, the mountain here and do that. Clearly, that didn't really work out when I had, um, who was here? Like, John or Michael, one of them was supposed to be mining, but they didn't, um, didn't really do that. So let's make this big room here eventually. And that can be for, that can be for storage of those objects. Good on you, Anton. What are you making? The roof, probably. Anton's just going to do his thing. So we can have basically all of the veggie items in this serving basket. So I guess I can get rid of these ones that are on the floor. Why don't I? And we'll allow meat to be there so that um, just in case there's an overflow. Yeah, that makes sense. Look, the cats still keep bringing back bunnies and everything. So that means that um, we're going to um, still have heaps of hide and everything. Oh, Anton's depressed. Why are you depressed, man? Oh, now you like your job? I don't know. He's lonely. Oh, that's so sad. I thought you were talking to the cats. I could be wrong. Oh, we've got Jeanette, a traveler. She's coming in. Wonder, hopefully she's a worker. I don't know, though. Time will tell. Here she comes. Gosh, that bridge is so much better. Oh, she wants to rent a room. Of course you can. Please come in, rent a room. It's nice and warm in here. There's plenty of food. And we'll eagerly await the next day. Look, they're pooping together. That's cute. <laughs> Eventually we'll be able to get a table that they can sit at to eat. It'll be really nice. Maybe I should make this like a little dining room. I don't know. Maybe I should just open this whole thing up to be a, uh, a storage room. I'm not sure. Maybe we probably don't need it. Okay, Jeanette's on her way home. Jeanette, whatever her name is. <laughs> Anton's doing his thing. Gosh, I really miss John and Michael. I wish they were still here. They were doing some really good work.
We really need to get some extra peat going as well. We'll put that onto a 10 for a couple of those. What's Tony doing now? Oh, he's cooking. I think I really want him to harvest. Let's do that instead, Tony. Yeah, thank you. Because the, the peat bricks, we've got no wet peat bricks and we've got 19 dry, so it'd be really good to have some more of those. We've got plenty of food at the moment, so we're good. Oh, we're getting reputation with, who was that? Was that McDougal? Oh, look. Reputation level two with McDougal, nice. What have we got? One with McCulloch, one with Turnbull, or is that zero, I don't know. And same with Cameron. Beautiful. That little rat didn't stand a chance. Kitty got it. Oh, the mood is really low. You like hunting at least, so. You know what? I think Anton should just do something fun. I'm just gonna say he should do something fun because his mood is so low. So he's got some time off. I think he really deserved the time off. And hopefully we'll get another traveler soon. Just have to remember to put him back on to work eventually. <laughs> he can take the rest of the day off, I think. All right, I think he should go back to working. All right, so we've got plenty of food. What we need to work on now is just making things feel a little bit nicer so that when people come and stay, they're, um, you know, they're happy to be here. So let's just put mining as priority number one for you because I want you to start mining out these rooms here. So let's put this one here uh, let's make them as whoop, let's make them as well as a 10 so that oops bloody hell just yeah I want those <laughs> we'll mine those so that this will be nice and warm I wonder if that'll work like this room here will warm this whole section I don't know I guess we'll see what are we on day seven all right, Anton's got a big day of mining ahead of him. What are you repairing? Oh, the light so he can see. That would be nice, yep. Oh, we've got a job seeker on the way. That's going to be great. Who have we got for... Fergie... <laughs> Fergie Hart. <laughs> Fuck your heart. Uh, yep. That's, that's his name. All right. Fuck your heart. <laughs> Get to work, bud. Um, I might make fuck your heart's top priority. Oh, mm, let's do it as mining as well. Cause I really want this done. And then we can look at it after that. How many mining picks do we have? Pretty sure we have two. Yeah, we do. At least two. 
Oh, how much skill do you have in that, bud? You got pretty fast through that. Oh, only two. Oh, well. All right, here we go. We're starting to see the structure of everything come together now. So I'm going to put a little door there because this is going to be a bedroom. I don't really know why I put a door here, but that's okay. We're going to put a door there as well. Fuck your heart, if you could get some branches, that would be fairly helpful, I think. Or someone at least. Mind you, I like the fact that we've got the mining going on. Yeah, maybe we'll take this down a notch for Tony. Very good. Okay, so let's move one of let's move the bed. Actually, let me test it. It's eight degrees. Hmm. I could put like a little I could just put like a little fireplace or something in here. Let's try that. Uh, let's make that a 10 there and we'll put that little, um, put that, oh, we've got a cooking pot now too. When did that come in? I must have missed that one. I don't think that, does that give warmth though? No, a meat smoker, a stone fireplace. I'm going to put a fireplace in here. Uh, yeah, is that what I want to do? Yeah, I think so. Let's just put it here. I'm, it's just sort of an experiment. Let's just see how that goes. But I really need a door in here. I don't want this to be hot. Hmm. I don't know if I've like messed that up for the meat storage. I'm not sure. That's all right. If I have, I have. It doesn't matter. Go and gather, my friend. Yeah, drink zone is available there. Oh well. Alright, cool. So, oh god, look at all these boulders we've got. Wait, if I have a door there, I don't want that one there, just in case. I'm in two minds about this, clearly. Let's put it, uh, let's put it there instead. I don't know if that makes a difference. Let's just try. We're just trying different things, aren't we? Or should I move it further in? Hmm decisions I might move it just a little further in do I even need it this is 17 degrees in here probably don't even need it oh well, we'll build it anyway it can't hurt can it don't you fuck your hard and what's Anton doing? Oh, the peat. Awesome. Oh, Bug Iron Crusher. Definitely need that one. We'll do that one there. And we've also got a Traveler. Awesome. Growir. That's probably not how you say that name. Yep, we will rent a bed to you, Growir. That's no problem. We're really making some progress on this, which is really exciting. Uh, I'm gonna move, yeah, I'm gonna move this bed. Let's move it into this room here. Oh, of course, after everyone's had their little sleep. Still got six days worth of food, so that's really good, mind you. I'm a bit worried about that being 12 degrees in there. Look, some of the meat is rotting. Hmm. 
that's going to be an issue. Hmm. Gosh, we really need that that door to be done. Is that for that's building? Let's see who's a builder. I don't know if that'll help. Let's put him as the priority for building. Fergie hard. Going really well though. I think we'll be fine. Because the cats will still bring in extra. Oh god, look at these <laughs> rotten meat everywhere. The cats will still bring in extra animals and stuff, so we'll just get meat continually, which is really good. Um Yeah, I'm not worried about it. Anton is still sleeping. Mate, you must have been tired, dude. Who have we got? Oh, Gruy is leaving and we've got a job seeker, Duncan. Awesome. You came at a really good time, my friend. Anton, good on you getting the Pete. That's awesome. You know what, Duncan? I think I'm just going to make you on hauling, honestly. Damn, yeah, look at all the meat that went bad. That's all right. It'll be fine because hopefully we'll fix up this door soon. How many do we need? We need two branches for that. Bloody hell, man. Someone get some branches, please. <laughs> Put all these little ripe branches over here ready to go. You know what? Duncan. No, Fergie Hard's doing that. You know what we'll do? We'll make that a 10. There we go. See? There we go. It'll be fine. Compost. We need branches, logs, twine. What else for that thing? The timbery. We need logs, twine, iron ingots. How many iron ingots do we have? Three. Why can't I make these? What do I need? Charcoal and iron ore. Straw, branches. Okay, so we definitely need those branches. Here he comes making this door, so that's good. So for these rooms to keep warm though, we will need a vent in here. A fireproof vent. Yeah, probably a good idea. Does that work there? I think it does. We'll need a vent through to here too. So let's do a fireproof vent. On there. Yeah, I think that makes sense. All right, what's everybody up to? Anton's collecting the peat. Vergyahad is going to leave us soon. Duncan is going and collecting stuff, so that's good. So we need two branches for that door. We've got 66 in storage, so that's really good. We need a builder. Who's building? Building. Fergie Hug, can you build before you go? I wonder if he'll do that. I don't know. He might just go. Come on, mate. Just make that door for me, please. Oh, I think he's doing it. That's awesome. Thank you, Fergie Hard. You've done good work, mate. Lovely. So this should go back to being cold. Yeah, it is awesome. Yep, the plan is coming together, peeps. We're good. Look, all our neeps and shit are in there. That's awesome. I only got a little bit of meat now, but that's okay. Still got six days worth of food. It's probably because we've got these mushrooms and these onions that are roasted, so we're good. The bloomery will be quite. Um, not bloomery, sorry. The bog iron crusher will be quite important because it will give us the iron to then make the 
little iron ingots later on. Oh, we've got someone else on the way, a traveler. Oh, Jeanette. Same Jeanette or different? Probably different. Okay, you're doing your thing. Fergie Hard, what are you up to? Uh, building. Awesome. You're a good boy. We've got heaps of dry pre bricks now, which is awesome. Hello, Jeanette. Yes, of course you can rent a bed. How many beds do I have? One, two, three, four. Okay. So we can have one more person. Yeah, the more I think about it, I don't think we need that stone fireplace. So I'm going to take it out. That's better. Now those... All the meat isn't going to go bad now. That's great. Winter is almost over. We're on day eight. We're about to be in day nine. What do we need for the twine? We need straw. That's cool. We'll get around to it eventually. What do we need more of? Bug iron. Crusher will come in handy. No more berries, that's weird. Do they go bad or something? I don't know. Look at the bad meat. Oh well, that's okay. Ooh. Turnbull just liked us a little bit more. So who's friends with us? Level 1 McDougal. Did that go down? McCulloch's level 1. Turnbull's level 1. Cameron's level 1. I thought McDougal was at a level 2 with us. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Who's a McDougal? Are you? Are you a McCulloch? That's a Cameron. Cameron. Okay, well whatever. can't please everybody can we we try though so who have we got on the way a job seeker and a trader Ooh, no way all right job seeker i'm gonna say yes to straight away obviously uh margaret the trader i can't do anything with this cow which is a real shame uh I'm not going to buy anything from you, Margaret. I could sell you the wood ash, though. Let's sell some wood ash to you. How much are you buying it for? Ten cents. Mm. Maybe that wasn't a good idea. <laughs> um, we'll sell one bit of dry or two. There we go. That's enough, Margaret. Thanks, Margaret. Yeah, I just can't afford to get those cows right now because I got nowhere to put them. The, the thing will die. So that's something for us to think about for later on as well. All right, Isabel. How are you going? Who are you with, Cameron? Um, oh, no. She has diarrhea. That's not good. From drinking dirty water. Oh, well. <laughs> um, so I need... Who have we got? We've got Isabel and Duncan. What was Duncan doing? He's hauling. Isabel, are you good at mining? What's Duncan? Oh, he's very good at mining. Well, Isabel, maybe you can haul? Let's try that. Put a door there. Yeah, and this can be our storage. We'll get all of this stuff out of here, like these rocks and stuff. And we'll put them in a big storage facility inside. Bye, Margaret. I forgot she was the trader. So, Isabel, what are you doing, mate? Whoa! There's the wolves. So, you're... That's good. You're. Uh, what are you doing? Are you gonna kill us? I hope not. <laughs> I really hope not, because that would 
just put a dampener on my day. I wonder if they go for the cats. I don't know about that actually. Uh, we've still got f neglect. What the hell? What do you mean neglect? Do I not have another pet bed for you? Oopsie. This whole time I haven't had four pet beds. What an idiot. <laughs> yeah, if he can do nothing else but that, that'll be great, actually. So she's hauling. God, it's all coming together. Anton's doing the peat. What's this building? Who's doing building? Uh, I might move Anton's priority to building because we're going okay with the peat now. She'll haul those peat bricks back to the the rack and they'll dry. So we're good. We'll get this bog iron crusher going and then we can get some extra iron in there and we can make some iron ingots and then progress through that as well. Great. Okay, let's do iron ore. We're going to make sure that we have... What do you think's reasonable? Like 20? Let's just do 20 each time. What do we need for an iron ingot? Oh, you need 25. Okay, let's make sure you've got 25 at least. Oops. Uh, okay, yeah, 50 will do. And then what about the charcoal? Making sure we got 50. That's good. Okay, that's, that sounds really good. Okay, these fields are coming together nicely. Food is still okay. We've got heaps of food. Eels, got cooked meat. We've got these roasted onions still here. And the dried mushrooms. Oh, there's more cooked meat. We got heaps. Well, tomorrow is the last day of winter. So we've successfully made it through winter. I can't believe it. <laughs> How's everyone feeling? How's Isabel? No, she's not has doesn't have a satisfaction max. But that's okay. As we progress further, we'll have everybody have a lovely room. Um, you know, I wonder if we can put some like tile flooring down. You know, that'll be a bit nicer. Let's see if I can maybe put it in there. Let's see the tile flooring, building floors. Oh, we can only do brick floor. I wonder if that's because we haven't made enough tiles to discover it yet let me just have a quick look through through these ideas tile flooring can i see it brick wall tile floor okay we need to make another 50 tiles that's cool let's make some more tiles screw it let's make some more bricks as well we can always use more of those beautiful Great, and now we're in the last day of winter. Oh, she hates harvesting. Um, let's not get her to do that. Let's get him to do harvesting. Yeah, instead of the mining for now. These are getting wet. I might... I wonder if it's worth me just building a roof over them. Mind you, these roofs still haven't been done. Maybe I'll hold off on that for now. That's all right. We can do that later. Doesn't really matter. Okay, so Isabel's going to leave us. Why is she going to leave us? 
Oh my gosh, look at all these people coming. Why is the why is the female symbol red? I don't know what that means. Satisfaction, blowout, shame, and well fed. Is this sort of counteracting each other? All right, who have we got? Who's this? Huchin? Huchin? Don't know how to pronounce that one. <laughs> um, I don't want to buy any of those. There's a dog though. No, Huchin, I think we're good. Thank you. Who else have we got? All right. Kristen, what are you? Oh, you're a worker. Let's hire you. Marit, what are you? You're a trader. Uh, no, I don't want any of those. You can go. And then we've got one more person coming. Lachlan. I think he's a job seeker. Yes, we're going to hire you, Lachlan. Very good. Oh, we need a sickle. Let's make a sickle. What's uh, the skills of these people that have just come in? Oh, wow. She's really good at hunting. Um, Lachlan, what do I want you to do? Um, let's just leave you as is, Lachlan. You look pretty okay. I need, actually, what's this one? Crafting. I need someone who's crafting. Where's crafting? Hello? All right. Um, Lachlan, you can be crafter. Thank you. Oh, we need a stone hoe as well. Okay. God, we need a lot of things, don't we? Okay, Lachlan's doing that. What's everyone doing? Isabel, you're not happy. Why are you not happy? You still got blowout shame. Anton, why are you walking across the water, dude? You got a perfectly good bridge there. <laughs> oh, you're doing the peat. That's good. Yeah, you know what? Let's harvest all this peat. You're still carrying stuff. What are you doing? You're crafting. Um... Isabel, don't craft anymore. I know you don't like it. I mean, haul. Do something else instead. Oh, she's hunting. She likes hunting, I think, doesn't she? Yeah. Yeah, she really likes hunting. Well, why don't we do that? Make that her priority. Where are those wolves gone? Maybe she could hunt those wolves. I don't know. What about branches? Can I get branches from here? Someone can take the branches from there. Oh, is that it? No more branches from those trees. That's weird. It's all good. Do I have enough beds? Oh, no, I don't. Okay. I'm going to have a sleep zone somewhere. A bit unconventional. Let's just put it there for now. Oh, we need a peep spade. Gosh, it's so much easier when there's more workers. <laughs> I'm going to say that we don't need any workers right now because what we really need is we need some um, people to stay over so that they can pay us money so we can pay the workers because, oh dear, we've got 221. We'll see how it goes. Hey, look though, the eels are back working. That's our sign that we're almost, almost back to, to spring, which is very exciting. What's happening? Duncan, you're doing that. That's very good. Um, do you know what, Duncan, could you maybe do these ones as a priority and maybe this one as well? The reason I'm saying that is because I'd love to make that little bedroom, get that up and running. The fields. 
Uh, we're going so well. We've got two days worth of food. That's going to be fine because these eels are going to come through soon and we'll be good. Okay, so we've got tile floor, etc. I wonder if I make tile floor, it make, gives 10 to indoor environment. It does give a speed bonus, which I don't care about. But I wonder if I do tile floor here, will that make these guys... Oh, I don't want that one. Will that make these guys happier when they're in their lovely room and they have a tile floor? I'm hoping so. Okay. There. And last one. Here. There we go. Alright, so we need a little door to this room as well. Very nice. I need to make another sleeping mat. Mind you, should I make this a double? Hmm... No, if I need to, I'll put a double in this one. Let's make another sleeping mat in here. I know we don't have enough straw, but tomorrow is spring, so that'll start growing again. You know, we'll just have to hold on a little. But that's okay. And then for next season, what we'll do is we'll um, do things like harvest heaps of heather, um, and the bluebells as well, because those traders wanted to trade heaps of those. So that's really good to know for next time. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Yes, we've got enough beds. That's good. Wonderful. And are these rooms still warm? They are 19 degrees. Yeah, look at that. So that oven is just heating this whole section. And that bit is staying nice and cool. Well, here we are, folks. We're into spring. We've made it through the first winter. We are thriving. We're not only surviving, we are thriving. So thank you very much for joining me for Clan Folk. Little Anton is doing his best. All his workers are here hopefully we'll get some more people who want to stay over and we can actually pay them <laughs> anyways uh, my name is smocks from celebrant quest please like the video subscribe to the channel and i will see you in the next episode of clan folk take care everyone bye